Homeroom teachers can create folders in their Seesaw class to help organize student work into content folders or folders of work done for specialists. You can access these folders on the Journal tab in the Class Journal section by clicking on the folder icon. This will show work for students that has already been reviewed and approved and categorized into these folders. This makes it easy for a specialist to go back and quickly find and review any work that was tagged with their folder. You can add these folders here on the folder view by tapping on manage folders and then creating a new folder if you don't already have one. Giving that folder a name, choosing a color for the folder, and then tapping the green check mark. Students can also access work in these folders by going to their digital portfolio or folder and tapping on the folder icon beside their name. Here they can see what work they have submitted that's been reviewed and approved and tagged with one of these folder names. This allows students to also get back to work that they've done for specialists quickly. Student work can be put into folders in a couple ways. First, teachers can tag activities with folder names before they even assign them to their class. By doing this, teachers will save themselves a lot of work later when reviewing items and having to tag folders for each item at that point. Teachers can do this by going to the green plus, assign activity, Selecting their activity either from my library, their school library, the district library, or the Seesaw community. And then assigning the activity to their class. And tapping on folders over here on the right side. Then tapping the folder tab. And at this point the teacher can select whichever folders are relevant for this activity. So maybe this activity is for this specialist and it's also a PE item. Now I can tap the green check to save that and assign this to my class. Now when students complete this activity and the teacher reviews and approves it, the work will automatically be filed into these folders listed here. Teachers can also add folders on the journal tab as they scroll through the journal feed. They can see if they've already assigned a folder to an activity. They can also tap on the folder and add additional folders. Tapping the green check mark will save this additional setting and now they'll see an additional folder listed for this work to be filed into. By using folders to organize student work in the homeroom teacher's class, if specialists are tagging their activities or student posts with either their name or their content subject, it will save them time later if they're looking back for student examples by being able to go on the journal tab to the folders and quickly pull up the work that was submitted and tagged with their folder. Specialists can also go to individual students tap on their folders, and again, find the work that that student submitted for them quickly in the folder. Using the folders to organize student work in the homeroom teacher's class will ultimately save a specialist a lot of time of scrolling through the entire journal feed trying to find student work.